what is up guys this is karan here welcome back to tech karan youtube channel this is a minuai 12.2 premi os v 2.3 which is available as a port room for redmi note 8 users if you are using any other device like redmi k20 it's officially available for you if you're using any other device maybe a gsi is available for you so you can install this right now we are going to review gsi which is premi os v 2.3 which is based on minuai 12.2 I'm going to share with you is it better than the normal MIUI 12 and it has the better and extra features than MIUI 12 a lot more things in this video so let's get started quickly guys this is actually based on a MIUI 12 and has all the main features from MIUI 12 if we talk about the floating windows if we talk about the dark mode and almost everything is perfectly fine here available in this latest MIUI 12.2 based Premi OS actually I have applied a theme that's why the, this kind of things are available here you can simply go to the theme store and I'll provide the link in the description for this theme which I have applied right now which is called this one actually it is in Chinese I've changed the wallpaper the icons and status bar looks nice so that's why i have applied that also if we talk about this we have a lot of themes available as a pre-installed which you get in miui pro room and maybe some a little bit of other rooms available here and there and these are some themes which you can apply directly by going here if you want to these are themes which looks these kind of things if you want to apply them it all depends upon you can apply them directly these are available pre-installed also if you go to the font section we have a lot of fonts available so if if you want to apply any font from here for example this you can simply click here and it will start applying and the font should apply directly if no errors occur and here it is these are applied successfully right now you can see the fonts are applied and also this is a GSI build so there might be bugs here and there depends upon which vendor you have used so if you use a vendor with less bugs there might be less bugs for you if you use vendor with more bugs there might be more bugs for you talking about some things which you get here first of all as I already told you it has all the main features from MIUI 12 if we talk about the control center yes you can enable that in settings right now in Redmi Note 8 I have not enabled it yet I don't want it to enable it so that's why I left it and by swiping right we have the Google Pixel feed which you can enable or disable directly from the settings if you want to you can go to the settings option if you go to the lock screen options we have the always on display option available and yes these kind of things you can enable these kind of things you can use if you want to but i'll not recommend you because we have the lcd display as redmi note 8 and some other devices which have the lcd display i'm talking about that if you're using a device with amoled display then you can use that if you want to we have the sleep option we have the smart cover mode option available here power menu access quick settings access and always show notifications so it has a little bit of extra features and here we have the colors customizations which you might not get in the stock miui 12 some side panel shortcuts charging animation and little bit of things here and there Moving on to the display options, we have the dark mode, we have the reading mode, system fonts, text size and font weight. I'm just reviewing Premi OS, I'm not saying I'm not talking about any bugs or anything else because bugs depend upon your device. If you move on to the control center, yes, you can simply enable the control center if you want to. Let me show you the control center, how this control center will look like, like this. Uh, in my case, control center looks kind of interesting, but I didn't want it to install it, I didn't want it to use it, so I have just left it. We have the colors for selection of tiles also, fonts, colors, smart home, status bar style, which you can change. We have the option to change this to MIUI, iOS or AOSP. So these are some cool kind of features which you get in this build. We have the other clock mode 24 hours second we can choose to 20 12 hours second like this so it depends upon you whichever thing you want to customize there are a lot of things available and this is one of the best alternatives of minui pro room which is actually paid room so uh, not all of the guys can buy that and i don't think so any one of you should buy that because room is room i don't think so it should be there to pay for something these kind of things we have a lot of other rooms and alternatives available for that battery icon style battery indicator and a lot more things if you want to try it out it all depends upon you we have the size customizations for your status bar icons like the notification icons clock size and a lot more things 
now let's move on to some other things notifications we already know about home screen also have a little bit of extra customizations we have the wallpaper section available where we have the super wallpapers so if you also want to apply the super wallpapers you can apply them and we have a lot of system wallpapers available too like these we have 27 system wallpapers available so if you want to apply these wallpapers it all depends upon you can apply these one too other things are kind of same so no extra things are available here and there all the things i have already shown you almost everything is perfectly fine here right now i'm using this magic version v20.3 in my case it's perfectly fine i didn't got any extra issues here and there so no issues for me all the things i have already shown you these were the things i just wanted to share with you the link for the gsa is in the description you can go and install this and if you don't know how to install a gsa you can simply install a lot of things simply install system image you just need system image from this premi os we need a vendor image for that we need boot image and these kind of things you can simply install this and how to install it easily i have a link for that video you can go and check it out now this was all thanks for watching goodbye